Hello friends, welcome back, hearty welcome to you. In this session, we'll see how to find out the equation of the parabola whose axis is parallel to x-axis and which is passing through three different points. So we know first that axis is parallel to x-axis. Axis is parallel to x-axis. What will be the equation of the parabola? Equation of the parabola will be y minus k whole square is equal to 4a into x minus h like what we did in the last session we can simplify this and we can say general equation of this is x equal to ly square plus my plus n once we know the general equation is x equal to ly square plus my plus n we can go back and substitute the different points there first let us take the point minus 2 comma 1 so minus 2 equal to L plus M plus N. Similarly, I can substitute next point 1 comma 2. If I substitute 1 comma 2, I will have 1 equal to 4L plus 2M plus N. Similarly, if I substitute point minus 1 comma 3, we will have minus 1 equal to 9L plus 3M plus N. Now I am doing this in quicker way when compared to the earlier because you already know what is the concept we have to do. We have to simplify first and second equation and second and third equation. Get two equations in variables L and M. When I subtract one from the two, I will have minus 3 equal to minus 3L minus M. Minus 2 minus 1 is minus 3. L minus 4L is minus 3L m minus 2m is minus m n and n will cancel or can I say 3 equal to 3l plus m this is our one equation similarly when I subtract second from the third or third from the second I will have 1 minus of minus 1 2 equal to 4l minus 9l that is minus 5l then I have 2m minus 3m that is nothing but equal to minus m so this is our second equation. Now we'll take these two equations. We'll try to solve and find out the value of L, M and N. So we have 3 equal to 3L plus M. And we have 2 equal to minus 5L minus M. When I add them, M, M will cancel. I get 5 equal to minus 2L. Or can I write down L equal to minus 5 divided by 2. If L equal to minus 5 divided by 2, I can go back and find out M because M equal to 3 minus 3L which is equal to 3 minus of 3 into minus 5 by 2 which is equal to 6 plus 15 by 2 which is equal to 21 by 2. Now once we know L equal to minus 5 by 2 and M equal to 21 by 2, let's go back and find out what is the value of N. We know L equal to minus 5 by 2 and M equal to 21 by 2. So, let we know one equation which says that L plus M plus N is equal to minus 2, the first equation. So, we know L value minus 5 by 2 plus M value that is nothing but 21 by 2 plus N is equal to minus 2. We can simplify that and we can say N equal to minus 2 plus 5 by 2 minus 21 by 2. When I simplify this, I will have minus 4 plus 5, 1 minus 21 minus 10. We can check that minus 10.5 plus 2.5 minus 8 point mi minus 8 minus 2. That's minus 10. You can take LCM and you can check that. This is value of n which is equal to minus 10. Now, what will be our equation? Now, x equal to L into y square, L into y square. So, we have to write down L value. L value is minus pi by 2 into y square plus m into y. m is nothing but 21 by 2 into y plus n, which is equal to minus 10. Now, let's try to get everything to left hand side and multiply with the 2. So, what we will have now is if I multiply with 2, it will become 2x and when I bring it here, it will be 5y square minus 21y plus 10 equal to 0. So, 
the equation of the parabola whose axis is parallel to x axis and passing through the different points is 5y square plus 2x minus 21y plus 20 equal to 0 because I have to multiply everything with 2. That's nothing but 5y square plus 2x minus 21y plus 20 equal to 0. 